When I walked up, I just felt the warmth. You know, I felt the comfort. The holidays may be merry and bright for some, but for people with childhood trauma, the light might be dim this holiday season. I was raised in the foster care system. Um, I was taken in by a family who loved and supported me uh, just like I was their own. I got to know my mother through writing letters um, coming from the prisons. We have a generational uh, history within our family of receiving letters from uh, incarcerations, uh, from my mother, my brothers, and now my nephews. Kamika Hubbard broke the cycle. She's sharing her story at the ACE Resource Network's Holidays Are Hard tree lighting event. I believe in the power of sharing your story to help heal hearts. Creating a safe space is what ACE Resource Network Executive Director Sarah Marika says the campaign is all about. We're here to share messages of hope and healing um, for people in Sacramento and beyond. They can access information, supports, resources, tips and tools so for navigating the holiday season. The so-called number story tree outside the LGBT Community Center in Sacramento is there through the month of December. If you come down here in person, you can scan the QR code, learn more about the tree, access resources, and there's a web-based switch online. Anyone anywhere can activate to turn on a light on this beautiful strawberry tree. This tree, a symbol for those who may be struggling this holiday season. It's not a traditional tree. Having a space to come to that's not a traditional setting can allow them to develop a new way of celebrating, you know, giving them a new life. Andrea Flores, KCRA 3 News. In addition to the tree, the ACE Net Resource Network is hosting a Found Family Fest that's coming up Sunday, December 18th from 4 to 8 p.m. at the Sacramento LGBT Community Center, and that is open to the public.